Believe it or not, there is actually a lot of news today, other news we can tell you about, including the first of six funerals for the victims of Monday school shooting in Nashville. And authorities have released 911 calls from inside the school as the shooting unfolded, and we have to tell you they are extremely upsetting and disturbing. They include at least one call from a teacher who was hiding in a closet with her students. Mark Straussman has the latest from Nashville. Minutes after the shooter entered the Covenant School. I'm hearing rapid fire. Police dispatchers received a flurry of hurried 911 calls. I hear another shot. You did? I'm hearing more shots. Behind the hushed voices, sirens, and crying. Try to stay quiet. I don't know what's going on there. But, um... A woman sheltering in an office told dispatch at least one staff member in the building carried a firearm. We do have a school person or two, I'm not sure, that would be packing that are whose job it is for security, um, but I don't, I mean, we don't have security guard, but we have a staff. It's unclear if any school staff had weapons that morning. On Thursday, three days after those terrifying moments, parents and students rallied outside Tennessee State Capitol in Nashville before bringing the protests inside. Where the Republican-led legislature was back at work for the first time since the shooting. Inside the packed rotunda, state troopers kept back demonstrators pleading for new laws limiting access to guns. Evelyn Dickhouse will be buried later today, one of three children gunned down in their own school, all of them nine years old. For CBS Mornings, Mark Strassman in Nashville.